I mean, the biggest thing for me being a firecracker is you're part of something. Like, you're part of a program that I'd say at least for, for me, hundreds of kids came before me. They set a standard of play. They set a standard of pride of what it came for. It's not just about the softball. It's not just about the school. It's about life. Being here at the beach, I love the fact, I love the waves, I love the tranquility, and I love the almost eruptive, stormy side of the waves crashing. You hear that. That's what I love. That's my favorite thing. The biggest difference for me on and off the field is off the field, I just kind of try to live life as it comes. And then on the field, I have a specific purpose. I know exactly what I want to get done in that day. You know, I go out there with specifically set goals kind of in life. I mean, off the field, I just kind of try to take it as it comes. It's about the person you are and the player you're going to be. It's not about what you're doing here and now. It's what you're going to end up doing. It's the change you're going to end up making whether it be on the softball fields or in a job, being a doctor, being a firefighter, being a police officer, all those different things, these things on the field, these lessons we learned, I said, I can see it in all the girls I've played with and how we've all grown up and we've all chosen different professions and I just see those times on the field relate back to what they're doing now. Some of the best experiences I've had in softball, they would have to be just doing things that no one ever expected us to accomplish. Um, getting one of the highest rankings in Louisville softball history. Winning a more league title at Poly when we had never done it. Getting invited to a USA tryout and not expecting it at all, really. And being able to compete on that field and then, you know, to me, those are the most important experiences in my life, doing something that really wasn't expected, creating change in programs. Some of the toughest experiences I've had is, I've had those days where you go over four or four strikeouts in a championship game. And as much as I'm concerned with my own performance, we still won. So I know, and I've done it at the highest level. I've done it at you know, 12 and under, 14 and under, 18s. I've done it at every level and really just being able to go out there the next day and know that the day before doesn't matter anymore. It's a new day. I have new goals and new accomplishments I want to do. I play with honor for everybody who's come after me and who came before me. Honestly, that is the greatest feeling ever going Going to Poly actually was really where I learned what it means to be part of something, to be part of a tradition, to have a standard upheld. And really, because look, our motto is the scholars and champions because we're so high in academics, but we're so high in athletics. And that was everybody who came before, like they set that standard. And imagine what it has taken to be on top of that. And I'm not talking softball, I'm just talking about a school in general of like what you're going into and not really realizing that before I got there, but realizing what it meant to wear that across your chest and how much pride people took and having their families go there. You know, my you'll hear a lot of the different families, oh, my brother went there, my sister went there, my dad went there. And you see the pride in them when you wear that uniform, when you get to be a part of something and get to be a part of that school. And to me, that's the same pride that I feel and that I felt wearing a firecracker uniform. That's the same thing. It was, you know, seeing different generation sisters come into this program and, you know, some of my family has played in the program. And to me, that's the biggest thing is realizing there are those who came before you and that you know what, they made you proud to be on the field. They did something so that you could be here.